I am Celeste Rabimbi Cortesi and I am your Miss Universe 2022. Bonjour ou bonsoir tout le monde, je suis Hong Manita, Miss Univers Cambodge 2022 et je suis maintenant euh, dans Manila, en Philippines, pour, mon, euh, pour, pour la compétition de l'année prochaine. Okay. Merci. Oh, Hello everyone, we're live with uh, Miss Universe Cambodia, Manita Han, the birthday girl. Happy birthday, Manita, and welcome you. to the Philippines. So, uh, how is your experience? First impression about the country and your so experience? Far, so far, well, it's big. It's different from Cambodia, but we can see we can see uh, that it's still in Asia, though. And it's really well different, and I'm really excited to see a lot more of the country. So, um, what, what made you decide to push through with your training here in the Philippines? So, we all know that uh, Philippines is well known, actually, for beauty pageants, right? So, I think that this is the best uh, country and a really good opportunity for me to be able to build up my skills for the competition. Okay, so um, who, who will be in charge of your training? So I'm training at uh, KF Camp. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And what would you like to improve on yourself during your well, training? Well, everything, because I believe that there's all, always um, doors to for improvement. And so I know that I like a lot of things, and that's just normal as a human being. I'm always learning. And so this is very a very good opportunity for me to be able to train both my catwalk, Q&A, makeup, everything that I need to have and get ready for the competition. I see. And uh, is there like a platform or a advocacy that you're trying to push through? So I really want our youth to be able to know that education is very important. It's actually the starting point of your future. So if I, actually if you focus on your education, you'll be able to have a great future. I know that this is repetitive, that I know that a lot of people will have told them that, like teachers, parents, everyone, but maybe it's not crucial enough, maybe they don't understand enough that this is very important. Your education is very important for you to have a better future and to improve your country as well. So this is how important you are right now. Okay, so um, recently, uh, the Mini Miss Universe has been subject to bullying because of her weight gain. Okay. What is your take on this? But I would say that why are we still looking up to physical appearances? She is our Miss Universe, so why are you focusing on her appearance? I mean, there is there is much more than that. This is why she earned the crown and she wear it very well. She is not, she shouldn't be bullied for just physical appearances. Like, it, it happened to me as well. Like, I lost weight during the competition, like now I'm gaining it back again. But I don't know why people should be focusing on that. Okay, if I, if I lose weight, people will say that, mm, take care of your health. This is unhealthy for you, but why do we get bullied if we gain weight? I mean, maybe, maybe even though she is a beauty queen, why is gaining weight a problem? This is, this is a problem in our society. So please, bullying isn't good in any way. So love her. I mean, however she looks like, however she is, she deserves all the love. Very well said. And recently, Miss Universe announced that next year, the next edition, they will be allowing married women, mm -hmm. mothers, yeah. and pregnant women to compete in their fashion system. Mm -hmm. What is your take on this? Okay, so about this, I've heard it as well. So there's good and bad sides. I do think that it's open to everyone's opinions. And I do think it's also a good opportunity for a married woman and with child to join because I don't think that women should be limited in, a, in that certain way. However, it could also be very challenging for them as a married woman as having a child to join the competition because the competition is very, um, you really need time for it and it's very personal as well. So if you if you think you're ready for it, you still need to know that this is gonna be a really big challenge for you, but why not? Okay. What can you say about Miss Cambodia's communication skills? Just leave your comment below and start subscribe to me for more pageant chica.